In this video, we will discuss the transparent commands in Civil 3D. So what are transparent commands? Firstly, let's discuss where you can turn these on if they aren't already turned on. If you navigate to the View tab, use your interface panel and then toolbars, you'll see you have the Civil and then transparent commands. So this is a toolbar. It is not in any ribbon interface at all. And what the transparent commands are is they are commands that will work transparently. In other words, in the middle of a operation. And that includes any operation. It could be a civil 3D operation or it could be a regular AutoCAD operation. If you look here, they are categorized. You'll notice here that the different angle distance, bearing distance, azimuth distance, etc. So basically, if you're creating data based upon any kind of bearing and distance, you can use any of these transparent commands. These are kind of the point categories. Then we have an alignment where you can do a station offset. And then, of course, we have the profile type ones where you can actually draw profiles. Those would be proposed profiles using station elevations or grade stations, etc. As an example here, let's go ahead and use the SO or station offset transparent command to draw a polyline that follows a civil 3D alignment. You can see here I've got an alignment. So I'll go ahead and just start the polyline command. And we'll go ahead and use the station offset command. If you're a typist type person, you can actually type in apostrophe SO, or you can simply click here. Notice how it prompts you to select the alignment. We are still in the polyline command. It's just working transparently. I'll go ahead and select the alignment. And then it says station. So I need to type in the station. Let's say this starts at four plus a pair. So I'll type in four zero zero and then enter. And then it prompts me to define an offset. Negative is left, positive would be right. So let's go ahead and type in negative 40. We'll type in negative 40, press enter, and it starts that right there. Notice how you can see the little plus sign there. Let's continue this and let's say we need to go to four plus 50. I'll type in 450, press enter, and then type a value of negative 45, and then enter. Notice how it's continuing to draw the pie line. We could keep going with the station offset, but let's say we were done and we actually wanted to, let's say, snap to something in the AutoCAD file. To get out of a transparent command, what you do is you press escape once. Don't forget that. That puts you back into the original command that you started. So now I have all the default command line options like arc, where I can change to an arc here. And then now I can just click in space with just regular AutoCAD functionality here. Once I'm done with this one, I either press enter or escape to get out of the regular AutoCAD command. Don't forget, these transparent commands work with every command, whether it's regular AutoCAD or Civil 3D commands.